Hello, and welcome to Prison Architect, prison building slash manager simulation a game by Introversion. It's currently available now on Steam in early access, but I believe it's coming out, or it's, uh, I guess tentatively slated to come out in its full release sometime a little later this year, like November, December, something like that, I think. But it's in a complete enough state, and I've been really looking forward to it for a little while, so I figured now is as good a time to dive in and give it a try. I uh, just finished the tutorial, and I'm having a... I guess this is going to be our first prison. So to start off with, let's have a read of the CEO's letter. Uh, Dear Sir Madam, uh, Congratulations on completing your basic induction. You are now a fully qualified prison architect. Soon you'll be designing, building, and running your own prison starting from nothing but an empty plot of land and a few stacks of bricks. Before you get started, I thought I might share some important lessons with you. 1. Every prison needs a warden. He should be one of your first hires. Build him a nice office and he'll open up a whole range of advanced facilities via the bureaucracy system. Individual jail sales are expensive, especially early on when funds are very tight. Save money by starting with a single large holding cell, which can be shared between many prisoners at once. 3. Get your kitchen and canteen up and running before the first prisoners show up, and be sure to hire some cooks. Nothing irritates a prisoner more than an empty stomach. Many items require a water connection. Water is provided by a water pump station, and pipes are built in the utilities view. Use small pipes to connect individual items together, then large pipes to connect back to the station. Small pipes can only carry water so far before they lose pressure. That's about everything. Good luck. The CEO, Prison Architects Corp. P.S. Share tips with fellow architects at prisonarchitect.com. Alright. And as you can see, I've sort of already started building out a bit of a prison here, starting with a, just a fence and designating some storage and just modifying the default delivery and garbage areas a little bit. And this is what I'm thinking is going to be our front door. <clears throat> Actually, since we're still in the planning mode here, I should probably just tick those off. Oh, I didn't realize this is a 3x3. Three three. That could be interesting. How do we want to fit doors in here? I think we want just a regular door. Oh, that's rooms. Sorry. Uh, let's see. I guess we want just a regular door for the entrance, maybe? Hmm. Yeah, since it's a 3x3, three three, that means that I don't think we really want free doors, and we can't really fit something like that evenly. Well, how much traffic are we really expecting in the front of the prison? So I think we'll set up something like that. We'll probably fortify this area a little bit more later. And actually, delete that. We don't actually want the door in yet. So back to planning. So, what we want, and one of these, I think, wings is going to lead off to the initial holding cells. This actually seems like a good sort of holding cell type area. This could be, I guess, leading off to the office -y type areas, and eventually visitor's wing. Actually, let's take a quick look at the office. Has to be four by four. Okay. And four by four. Desk, office chair. Hmm. Alright, because I like things to be neat. We'll move things over a little bit. I think something like that should work for our purposes. I guess I didn't really need to expand it, because now we have this extra hallway off to the side for no particular reason. Alright, let's fiddle with this. I'm a 
bit of a perfectionist when it comes to building things like this, so uh, bear with me here as I try building something I'm happy with. Maybe that'll do. And where is the holding cell? It has to be 5x5. Five five. This is 6x6, six six, so it's a little bit bigger than we need, but that's okay. Of course, if we do something like this, we could have the holding cell here, and then eventually, like, a build off visitation center and something of that nature. Okay. But in the meanwhile, let's kind of continue on with our planning. Since what I'm thinking is we want to. You know, the fact that's off center is kind of. 11. All right. So just something like that. I don't know what this is going to be yet. But we'll put some kind of door there, and then this can be the holding cell, and this can be whatever. Or no, that's not going to work, is it? Because this still couldn't be a hallway, because we'd have to put some kind of... Alright, you know what? Just, just forget it, don't worry about it. We'll build things in later. For the sake of... Simi no, 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 no. This is, this is all wrong. But we'll figure things out eventually. Yeah. So that, this'll work. We have a nice little one square hallway here, which... Should be alright, hopefully. Or there we go. Alright, so here we have two offices. Which is probably more than we need to start with. And a holding cell. I guess the next thing to do would be to uh, build off this and start getting a prison wing. Uh, what do we need for cells? A cell needs to be two by three, so something like that. Okay, so one, two, three. So we have four. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oops. Completely forgot why I was counting to three there. One, two, and three. So something like that. And I think we want two wide hallways just to help ease congestion. Nope, that's wrong. Okay, so we have something like this going. And we'll worry about that later. Do we want something the same on the other side? Something like that. Hmm. You know, I'm, I'm not sure what I want to make of this. Of course, then again, we could push the holding cells back here, and this could be something that actually would fit in this space. Delete, please. Alright, but I think that's enough initial planning. Wait, 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 wait. We also... Do we want to put the canteen and kitchen area here? Or should this just be a never set of cells? For symmetry, maybe that's what we want to do. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. One, two, and three. Means we want to extend this area down a bit. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Alright. There we go. Alright, I'm pretty happy with how this is turning out so far. And the more time we spend planning now, hopefully that means the less time we'll 
spend having things go horribly awry later. Of course, there's also the question of if we'll actually be able to afford building all this. We can also fit one more office down here. that. Yeah, that's about symmetrical. Okay. So something like this would be the cafeteria. Don't know why I did that. Or that. And... Hmm. You know, maybe this square area could be the yard or something. We still have to worry about showers. Maybe we can... No. We want to think about expandability here, so we'll probably... And accessibility, which is an important thing. Let's see. We'll do something like this. I, I really have no idea where I'm going with any of this, but... This will lead into more cells, I think. Yep. Right. Right. Scrap it. Scrap it all. Hmm. All right. Let's let's just get a foundation down, and then we'll figure this out. I prefer brick over concrete because it's more colorful. Something like that. And that. Alright, and we'll get started with this, and we'll figure out where we want to put the shower block. So I think the idea is we want to be able to expand these continuously upwards. Of course, it also occurs to me, do we really want to have all the prisoners this close to the entrance? We'll need to want, we'll want to get some kind of security set up in here, I think. Hmm. You know, I've watched people play Prison Architect before, and it seems so much easier when you're just watching someone else build these, kind of, these kinds of prisons and Sort of... Alright, so we need a door. Just a simple door, because we want to let people quickly come in and out of the prison. Put a staff door here, because no prisoners should be coming down here. We'll get a jail door here, and another one here. Then maybe large jail doors on either side. Oh! And I completely forgot about power! We need power and water in here as well. Oh, I didn't realize I could drag... I, I did just drag this thing, didn't I? Oh yeah, you can move this. Okay. Try to ignore that. Alright. So if the offices are... The office block is down here. Uh, how many... Let's see here. Doctor, dog handler... How many offices do we really need, I guess is the question. Alright, as we slowly... Start going from the planning stage to the actual physical concrete building stage. I can only hope I have not made a horrible mistake and measured these things out wrong. But 
Well, I think, I mean, that's what, that's the real fun, isn't it? Watching things go terribly wrong. That's why we're all here, aren't we? We, we secretly hope that this prison is going to collapse in on itself. Because that's where the real entertainment comes from. But at the same time, even when we want the prison to fail, we also want it to succeed, because we want to see it, I guess, become profitable and grow and just don't want a wall there. There. Don't know what's up with my clicking today. Actually, probably this whole first episode is just going to be me planning the prison. Let's see. I guess what we want to do now is fit power and water in here. Power is in here somewhere. Or is it that all of... Yes, that's all in the utilities menu. So, I guess what we want to do then... You know, we want to try building this in a future-proof manner. So, that there. Yep, that looks alright. And the water station will put a good distance away. We might build buildings around these eventually. Power switch, power station. A couple of capacitors, just to make sure that we're set. That's probably too many for what we have thus far, but we'll do the best we can. And something like this. Zoom that a little bit. Something like that. And kind of run power lines straight down like this. And like this. And we'll do the same for water eventually. And brick wall, where are you, brick wall? There you are. Let's uh, mark that in as well. Okay. I guess we might as well keep speed going at a lively pace while we. Nothing can go wrong at this stage of the game, I hope. There's die in the offices. Of course, I wonder how the warden and other, I guess, staff members are going to feel about having their office right on the other side of a wall from the inmates. Hopefully they won't mind too much. that. Nice desk like that. That filing cabinet for the corner. And I think that's pretty good. Also, for utilities, we might as well run an electrical wire straight down like this. Okay. Oh god! We are almost out of money. This is this is terrible. <laughs> oh god, what have I done? Now I know there's gotta be I know there's a button to sell all these at once, but I'm not sure what it is, and I don't wanna go check it out right now. Okay. Okay, I've made a horrible, horrible mistake and have built far beyond my means. The prison might in fact fail before it even gets going. Alright. Well. Well then again, all we need to do is get... Is this going to be our holding cell? 
I guess so. We just need this. Okay. Do we have? Do we have lights? Oh, you guys built the lines before you built the actual bloody power station. What are you guys thinking? No, this is all going horribly wrong. All right. This, for now. Okay. It's a toilet and a bench. To actually. Okay. Good. Good. We have power. All right. Don't freak out. Everything. Everything is going to work out just fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, we'll put a toilet and a bench. Okay, we don't quite have enough power, so let's run a line up here like so. I'm starting to think it was a horrible idea. Run the water line, something like that. Keep it one away from okay. something like this. And we need a power cable to connect that so we can get running water. And then a small pipe like this. And this. Go a bit shorter on this side since it should be fine. Okay. Now what seems to be the problem? That's odd. We look in utilities. This area seems darker than here. I'm not really sure why that is, but let's try not to think about it too much. Okay. Alright, so. I guess we probably want to try having a couple cells set up, and why am I stopping the timer again? Okay. I don't know why I'm getting so worked up. I mean, this is not a big deal. We're doing fine. Alright, put the toilet... Actually, no, the toilet should go against the back wall, shouldn't it? Oh wait, we'll cancel that. Toilet, 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 and toilet. And we are once more almost at money, so we'll cancel that and start making beds again. Put the beds here like this. And we are once again out of money. Oh, no. Again. Calm down. I have no idea why I'm panicking so much. We don't even have any prisoners in here yet. Imagine what's going to happen once I actually open the doors for business. We're going to be in for a fun time, I can tell you that. I'm freaking out already. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, I'm going to have to look up the wiki for this afterwards, since there's, as far as I can tell, no in-game uh, way to check what the controls are. Alright. So that should hopefully get us enough money... Speed up time again. And let's designate these rooms as cells, shall we? We just need a prison door here. Alright. Now, this is far too big a place for the kitchen. Actually, you know, something I had wanted to do but neglected to actually plan was to try having sort of like a staff corridor that like only the staff could access. But that doesn't really seem to have ended up being the case, did it? So... Let's see here. I think what we want to do is kind of... build a little kitchen off the side of the cafeteria here. As that is what we want this place to be. Staff room. Let's lower the speed a bit here, since I'm once again getting just needless no, speed up, speed up. We want speed. Kitchen. All right. Oh wait, 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 wait. Pause, pause. Just realized a horrible mistake I almost made. 
cancel that. Since we will need a door. Uh, we're not going to have anyone... Uh, that's rooms. We're not going to have any prisoners working in the kitchen right away, so we'll start off with a staff door and then, you know, eventually replace that with a proper kitchen door. Alright, so... No, this should be fine for now. And... No, I, I really think we should probably just mark this whole area off. Or should we? Because what if we need to expand the kitchen? That's a problem for another time. Let's see, we need serving tables, regular tables, and benches. So let's get those in there. Okay, regular table. So let's see here. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that'll be fine. Cancel that. Let's get right in here. Alright, and that's probably more than enough for... Oh yeah, we need a serving table. Let's see. We'll just stick these... Hmm. Just like that, I guess? Maybe a third one? No. I don't really care for how we ended up. Let's see. Cooker, fridge, and sink. Okay. Let's put fridge in there. A sink. And a cooker. Okay. Well, we're boned now. I guess we kind of have to let... No, we'll, we'll just say all. No, no! That's too many. Uh, what is our capacity? Four? Well... We had fun. But... It seems I've completely... Completely... Wait. All is not yet lost. Okay, yes it is. Okay, all is lost. Well, we're gonna have some angry prisoners for the first day or so, since we have no shower, uh, no kitchen. And why are you not working, sir? Oh, you don't have a bed. Well, we don't have money for a bed, so that's gonna be too bad, I guess. What is this? A stack of food trays. Ugh. You see, here this is my this is pretty much my problem with building games in general. I always uh, we'll we'll lock that shut for the time being because we don't really need it open, and no one needs to be in there. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah. Actually, um, I think what I'll do is wrap this episode up here, and we'll pick up in the morning when our prisoners arrive, which is in six hours and, well, about six hours. So, that should be fun. We'll see how terrible things end up going. We seem to be slowly making some money. Actually, wait, wait, wait a minute. All might not be lost. We can take grants, can't we? We can. Health and well-being. No. Build two offices, hire a warrant. Okay, we'll take that. And that. Okay, now we've got the money. Alright, so when we come back next time, we should hopefully be able to get things actually working in this hellhole we call a prison. A cooker.
There we go. Alright, so for now, I'll say thank you all for watching. Uh, don't forget to leave a like if you like the content, and subscribe to help with the channel, and I'll see you next time.